My name's uh, Mark. Uh, I'm recently retired and I'm at the big age of 62 now. And uh, yeah, so retired. So I've been training at CrossFit uh, for the last five years. So I've been here at Jorvik for um, just shy of two years now. And prior to that, I was in uh, forming uh, at Leeds. Um, in terms of training background, um, I've always been an avid um, sports fan. So whether it be football, rugby, whatever, tried everything. Um, but also a massive gym goer. Um, but also my real passion is, is karate. So the reason for getting into um, CrossFit was to improve my um, stamina and strength. Um, as I'm now training for my second down uh, black belt. So this has helped me um, stay a little bit faster and a little bit um, uh, stronger when you're fighting the, uh, the younger ones, let's say. Um, in terms of um, transferable learnings, I think that's how I'd sum it up, is that um, technique is everything. So whether um, it's at karate or whether it's at CrossFit, everything boils down to having correct technique. And um, so you start slow and you build and build and build. And before you know it, all those small increments um, give you that, that result that you're looking for. So yeah, and the thing about CrossFit is that, and just like karate, it's continual learning. You never actually get to the top. Um, why CrossFit versus a commercial gym? Um, I think with a, with a um, commercial gym, you um, can plod for a lot of years and um, you never see real improvements. And that boils down to uh, motivation, but moreover, poor technique. And I think also you, uh, with a commercial gym, you're very much on your own. What you've got at um, CrossFit, in particular at Jorvik, is a community. So it's all about, you know, it, it can be really individual, but it can also be the wider community here as well. And that's what makes it um, a lot more fun. And um, the continual learning, you never finish learning. And somebody's always better than you. And um, yeah, and it's the competitive side that brings out of you as well. So I think both the fun side, the community, but also the um, personal challenge of, of trying to beat the guy next year. Oh, you did the girl next year in most cases. Um, in terms of favourite moves, um, that's what we're really focusing on at the moment, which is basically um, deadlifts and back squat. I think they're really big uh, movements um, and it kind of suits my, my um, type of, of body, I think. Um, but again, it's learning all the new things, which are really challenging. And it can be the, the lowest weight, but boy, does it hurt. And uh, so what, what, what do I hate? Thrusters. <laughs> Every time. I'm sure I'm not the only one on that one. Anybody who's thinking of, of uh, trying CrossFit uh, for, for the first time is, um, is don't beat yourself up um, at the start. It's, it's, it's um, and train at your own level and speed. And, and it's all about small increments, it's CrossFit. Small bills, uh, bills and uh, over time you'll get the results. You've just got to stick at it. It's half uh, physical, but it's like half mental as well. So if you can overcome those things, um, you'll be successful at it and you'll really enjoy it. But I think you just stick with it, um, but manage your expectations. Uh, so small gains over a long period of time and you'll end up uh, not only improving, but also enjoying it a lot, lot more.